G'day and hello beautiful people, it is Mumo here. Hope you're having a fantastic day, afternoon, evening, night, no matter the time wherever you are, hope life is treating you well. And it's a bit of sad news for today and it is all about the Telltale series as I'm sure most of you know already, the Telltale series is shutting down. Now why is this so gut-wrenching and just heartbreaking? Because everyone on this channel, everyone watching this video loves The Walking Dead, myself included. And they had such a huge impact on The Walking Dead. They brought us Clementine. Like, I cannot stress that enough. They brought us Clementine, AJ. So many terrific and great characters in the Telltale series. So many loved characters. Lee! Oh my god, don't forget about Lee! She was only in the first season. No one forgets about Lee. So... You know, it is absolutely devastating and for myself who's a huge Walking Dead fan like many of you out there, it's... I'm, I don't like this. I don't like this news at all and at first when I heard it I was sort of like... It's fake. Phony. Fake. I'm too good for it. But unfortunately, an official statement was then released and from the company that explained it was shutting down. Now at first, the, they went from 300 or so employees down to 25 and we, and it was great because we're like, yeah, they're going to be finishing off the Walking Dead season, you know, the final season, definitely. No, and then it sort of come out, no, well, that skeleton crew's there to finish off the Minecraft story. Let's not judge them on that priority there. I'm not going to, but, you know, which one I would have finished. But anyways... And the Walking Dead uh, crew has essentially been already laid off with most of, like, 90% of the other employees. So, it's not getting finished. And then, after that, I was a bit of a... But, uh, what does this mean? Well, I guess we're at least getting episode two, but three and four... It's canned. It's canned. As long with the, the Wolf Among Us, Stranger Things, it's all done. It's... It's in the can. It's not getting finished. You know, Clementine and AJ aren't getting the ending, a proper ending that they deserve. We aren't going to get that ending. And I'm sure a lot of the Walking Dead crew that have worked tirelessly on these seasons and have done an absolutely great job. I cannot stress that amount enough. They were incredible with what they did with the Telltale series. Uh, they brought us Clem, guys. They brought us Clem Clementine. They brought us AJ. There's so many characters. I can just go on and on with the characters. They brought us so many quality moments within this game. And I'm sure, just like us, they're just as devastated, you know, not being able to finish off their baby. Because that's what it is. That's their baby. They've worked, you know, what is it, the fourth season now, the final season. You've had Michonne's off cut there. You've had DLCs with 300 days. So they've worked tirelessly and they've loved every moment of it just like us and it's their baby and they're not going to get to finish it. They're not going to get to show us the ending that they saw fit for this series and that's really, really disappointing. And I think out of most things, that's the most disappointment um, or the most disappointing fact of all this is not being able to give Clem that ending like, it sounds weird that we get so attached to characters, but that's why we get so into games is usually because of the characters and especially this game. And to not have Clementine have that ending, it's, oh, it feels devastating. It feels absolutely devastating. I'm a huge fan of the Telltale series and I have been since the first season. It's just, I just, I don't have no words, honestly. It's just, I don't know what to say about how much this sucks. And it does suck. Uh, I guess it's sort of the reality of everything doesn't last for, well, nothing lasts forever and everything has to eventually come to an end. And we always knew this was the final season, but just to have it ripped out of our hands, you know, to get all these teasers, the first episode, and then just, it's just been ripped out, ripped out of our grasp. Nope, you're not getting that ending. That's so so disappointing episode 2 the 25th of September we're gonna get to see that but like I said this the Walking Dead Telltale series it's not getting a proper ending the final season it's not getting a proper ending and there's nothing that annoys me quite like not getting a proper ending and I'm finished I'm fit oh I, I, it's gonna be I'm finished it's just no 
OCD me is kicking in right now. It's kicking in. You can't do that to us. But unfortunately, I think this company has been left with no choice. You know, I'm hoping, like most of you, that another company, another studio sees the potential. There's so much potential in a lot of these series and picks it up and finishes it. I would be so ever grateful. Let's, we'd all be so ever grateful if someone could finish The Walking Dead for us. Please, someone, please. But nonetheless, you know, I think, like most people, I'm a bit surprised actually because I never really kept up with the news of this company to know that they were in trouble. Like, you don't overnight just say, we're shutting our doors sort of thing. So there was obviously problems. I thought they were doing great. I was like, they're pumping out The Wolf Among Us 2, Stranger Things, you know. They've got all these great seasons, the final season. They're doing great. There's going to be plenty more to come out of this company. No. Apparently something was wrong is within the mix and you know, I know they've had a fair few CEOs within the last year or so So something was wrong. I didn't see it go into this degree, but obviously something was wrong You don't just shut shop overnight um, and it sort of sucks because this team had brought us Not only the walking dead, but the wolf among us that also the Batman series you got the the Borderlands series. There was so, it was just so much. It was, mm, mm, I don't even know where to go with it. Damn it. That's all I can say is damn it. If only it was, co no. Let's just say, um, br that brings me to what will happen to Rota's file. Absolutely nothing. That's Scopely's baby. Um, nothing's going to happen to that. In regards to their, I guess, entanglement or sort of, companionship I guess we could say with the Telltale series uh, I'm assuming you'll probably see future characters uh, from the Telltale series from this final season possibly I'm gonna assume that's still gonna recur this is not gonna affect uh, Road to Survival so like I said it's very very unfortunate that this has happened we're still there's a lot of uncertainties with it like we don't really know where it's going but we definitely do know right now you know the statements have said the Walking Dead, it's it's not being completed. So episode three and four, we aren't going to get to see that. Uh, and it's really unfortunate because, like I said, we all need that em ending. We all need that ending. Clementine needs that ending. But it doesn't look like we're going to get it unless someone else picks it up. I'm crossing my fingers right now. Unless someone uh, is willing to finish it off for us. Netflix, can you please? No, Netflix picks up everything that um, dies eventually, right? But, yeah... I thought I would throw it out there, have a bit of a discussion, and this a, it sucks. It definitely sucks. But there's there's so many uncertainties right now. I'm not going to sort of try and discuss what went wrong with the company because I don't have a hell of a clue what went wrong. Obviously, something went wrong because they don't you you know we're cancelling everything. Something went wrong, but. I don't know, I'm sure with all these employees getting sacked and everything will start to feed out of those walls eventually and we're going to start hearing what really went wrong and what was going wrong behind closed doors. I have no doubt in the next coming days. But as always, I hope you did enjoy. I thank you for watching, actually. I probably shouldn't say that because I don't thank you for watching because this is devastating. This is, Well, I do thank you for watching, but this, I, I hope you didn't enjoy. Yeah, that's what I should say. I hope you didn't enjoy because, you know, it's pretty devastating. Let me know what you think in the comments below and always remember how awesome you are. Bye. Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. Tis a light when the world is getting darker I have a dream where love's the only side So take my hand, join the army of the sun